Somehow, I lost the intro to this video, but who needs that when you have great content? So, strap up and let's dive right into Amnesia The Dark Descent Part 3. Let's go. Barely made it. I barely made it. Getting some parkour in this. Oh my. That's a long that's a long trek right there. It is what it is, man. Come on. Woo! I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm barely conscious. I'm dying. I am dying. I I can't take another hit from this guy. Oh my god, what do I do about him though? He is quick. Oh my. There's a room right here that I want to go in. Ooh. Damn it, I ran out of my oil. I can't see. I can't, I can't risk going in there right now. Oh, I can't, I can't. Oh, oh, that was a good jump. Nice. I don't think I, I don't think I can risk going in there right now. Do I? Okay, fine, okay, fine. We will, we will. I guess we will. Ugh. just made it. We barely just made it. Oh, I'm trying to see if there's some stuff over there, but oh, I don't know. Looks like a book. Looks like a regular book. I can't quite tell. Nothing over here. Oh, we got a skull. Sweet. Take some of that, dude. Munch on that. I'm sure you already have. Sweet. They definitely knew that we needed that health potion. Alright, all is good. We're looking fantastic on the health. <laughs> Man, I'm not doing good. I feel like I came in here for no reason. Get up, get up, jump, jump up. Why am I not jumping? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, no, why was... I think I know to keep out of the water, man. <laughs> I was jumping, I swear, I swear, I was jumping. Oh no. Oh. Mm. Come on, jump, jump. Dude, I'm having a tr tr trouble. Get this back up. Redo our progress. Not that I made it too far to begin with. Alright, not doing too shabby. I don't know, do we go back in that room and try to get the vial, or... We got a few cuts and bruises, you know what? I think, we, I think we're fine. Mm. I think we're fine. 
We don't need it. We're ballers. We're good. Let's let's just make it out of here alive. Is that like timed or something? Wait, I'm stuck. I am stuck. I am stuck. Oh, that's timed. I didn't I didn't know that. Wow. What, what is that? Is that a torso? Take that. Oh, he's eating it. He's eating it. Oh my god, go, 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 go. He's eating it. He's eating it. Okay. 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 Let's see how we gotta play here. Oh my. He's coming. I see him. I see him. Uh. Go over there. Oh, 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 never mind, never mind, never mind. Up, 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 oh. Did he eat it already? He didn't even eat it. He didn't even... Take another one. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. If I get hit, dude, I'm dead. If I get hit, dude, I'm dead. Come on. Come on. One more. Go grab that. Come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Open the door! Open! how we do. We're gonna open this a little bit right now. Open it. Okay, but not too long, not too long. Oh, I hear it. I don't know where he is. Is he still over there? Oh, he's still over there. Man, I wasted precious time. Wow, I didn't know he was still over there. Man. Okay. Take an arm, my friend. Take an arm. Go get it. Take that. And then take that. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. And then you're gonna take this one for good measure while we go. Oh. A hollow needle. A strong surgical needle. Lock with a simple lock. Um, I don't know if we're screwed over right now, guys. With a simple lock. And I don't have any keys. Did I miss something? I feel like I missed something here, guys. Oh, well, I mean, I obviously did, because... <clears throat> Unless I can unlock it with the needle. That's gotta be it. Let's put the needle on it. 
<laughs> nice. We figured it out. Good work. Good work, guys. Uh, good work, guys. Yes. Mm. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Keep running, keep running. Who knows if there's more. Keep going, keep going. Don't move, don't, don't stray. Is something following me? I feel like something's following me. Oh, I don't know, I don't wanna look behind. Don't look back, 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 don't look back. Keep going. What is that? I don't know. I don't know what's coming. I don't see it. I don't know. We're gonna keep going. We're just gonna keep moving. Is there a way to go over there? I don't know. I don't I don't I don't even want to stand still right now. Keep moving. Holy crap, is this a maze? Door, door, door. Mm. 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 I didn't even want to look back. I didn't. I didn't. Mm. No. <sighs> okay, finally, enough with the water. I'd like to say that I feel a little bit safer right now. But I know there's just gonna be something coming up ahead. Is that a baby's face? Is that a baby's face? That's a funky design. What does that do for me? Does that do any? Oh! Oh, it helps my health and... My sanity! Oh, that's nice. That is quite useful after that debacle in the water. <sighs> Finally, some rewards for my troubles. Thank you. The music's a little common in here too, you know? Makes you feel a little, a little okay. door opened but uh, do I want to go over there what's up here guest room oh it's just a room then yeah why not Are we looking for a journal? Hmm. Oh, it's oh, it's a bunny. I'm sorry. Oh yes, some oil. Thank you, thank you. We're not gonna put it in our oil canister just yet. Why do I keep doing that? Um, in case there might be a barrel somewhere, but... 2nd of July, 1839. I received a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of Herbert's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, returned from the desert. He was badly injured, as if maimed by a lion. The man rambled deliriously about the expedition being attacked by something horrible. The French quickly dispatched a search party to look for the expedition. After searching for days, they found the camp abandoned without any trace of Herbert or his <coughs> men. Tomorrow, I'll retrieve the things they recovered from Herbert's tent at the customs house. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. I would be quite worried as well. It's rough out here, man. Move. Go away. Get gone. 
No. Oh, I almost missed you. Not on my watch. Okay. In the box. I'm getting a little smoother with the controls. <laughs> As you can tell, hopefully. In the box. Sweet. A crowbar. Okay. 3rd of July, 1839. Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. I dug through the trove of documents he had carried and found a log detailing the expedition. The nature of this text ranged from quick notes to colorful <coughs> accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, we covered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion, but suddenly I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? Hmm. I don't think I necessarily have the story quite together yet. Um... Oh, I can sleep? Daniel? Oh. What? Still having nightmares, I see. Yes. I can't shake them. They come every night. We'll put a stop to them. You'll see. And I hope so. Okay. We're stuck due to a broken lock. Oh, right, mementos. Not in here. Okay. Easy. Just go another way. This way. Quite spooky in here. Just to keep me from going insane. Now this is Jesus. This is Jesus, guys. Is that supposed to be Jesus? Okay. <laughs> I ain't wrong about that one. Let's just go ahead and light that. Get that down. And the Bible. Wait. Biblia. Interesting. The discovery of an... Does that say orb? To my most trusted student and friend, John Weir. Trespassing. That don't sound good.
That was... This orb is some powerful, some powerful shit. Oh, Henrik. Hmm. Yeah, homie didn't make it. Sweet. Well, this is quite messy in here. But we shall see what we can find. Oh, hey, hey, it's the same dude I found the first time. Hmm. Uh, it doesn't seem like any anything of use is in here. Wait. me running running everywhere as if as if nothing's gonna come after me as if everything's all uh dandy yo look at that wow there's a bird oh my goodness look at that jeez Hmm. After a short study, it is clear that the agitation found among humans can be found in the dog. Fear and pain induce stress, which seems to trigger an enogenous response, causing the animal to burst with energy. I believe that the catalyst is produced in the brain. It's difficult to determine exactly where and what it is, but I can sense it. It reeks of cosmic genesis. There is an inherent problem in harvesting this energy since the creature is bound to die from the exercise. I mean, I must refine this process of torture to ena enable any real work to be done. More experiments must be performed, but it seems that only human beings are able to produce the amount necessary. Oh no, don't start working on people. It might be their ability to appreciate the severity of the process that ultimately augments their experience of terror. Man, who was doing this work? I know it wasn't my homie Daniel. Oh my, he had a bird in a cage. Let's see what you have to offer. <clears throat> ah, what a mess. I should have sharpened the saw, but I can sense it. It's definitely there. That voice sounds just like the Alexander voice of from the flashbacks with Daniel. Wow. Alexander, what are you doing? What are you doing? Huh. Some wicked man. <gasps> Dude's creepy. Got a whole thing of bones. Man. Alright. Let's keep going. Oh. Okay. Can't seem to make it that way.
Hmm. Oh, I see you. Oh, I see you. You think I don't? You think I don't? How do I get that? Any of these open? How do I get that? You think I don't see you? Oh, there's a whale here. You think I don't see you? Like that. Yes. There we go. Oh! Wow. It's... That gunk is all over. What is going on? Man, nowhere is safe, it seems. Oh, there's another one of those things. Let me just check around real quick. All right. When will it be my turn? Have I not shown restraint? My patience spans centuries. From where I came, mankind has not even wasted a breath, yet I bow to you. I have done so much for you and I have gained nothing in return. Agrippa, I trusted you. It was I who in all fairness should have entered that gate. Huh. What gate? Oh man, it's dark in here. How many tenders do I have? Seven! Let's utilize that. Can't see over here though. Flow cycle ride. Elevator machine instructions. If the elevator breaks down again, make sure to use the steam engine to build up pressure before channeling it into the machinery. Build up pressure. Adjust the levels to get the right amount of pressure inside the chamber. These meters should read up eight and down eight. Make sure the flow is set according to the flow charge. Trinity steam set functions. More phase, amplitude, complete steam flow cycle. Well, that seems quite important. Do they have an elevator here? A bit too dark over. Oh, yes. I knew there was going to be one somewhere. Nice. Good, good. All right. You know, we're doing pretty good right now. We are doing pretty good right now. Whoa. That fancy looking chest. Hmm. Those part people. Huh. So we go back now, I, I, I think. Let's go ahead and go back. Yeah. Remember when I said Daniel should leave this place? I don't know if it's that easy. I don't think it's that easy. Yeah, seriously, I'm running around with the confidence of, as if nothing will happen to me. Wait, is there, was there a chest in here? Oh, there was! Look at that! Nice. Let's go. Mm. Nice. Yeah, I feel like we're doing real good right now. In the beginning of this episode, not so much. Not so much. I got a slight headache. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. Don't forget your bag, Daniel. I won't, Herbert. There is no shame in using a parasol in the desert. As it happens, it's imperative to your survival. But it looks ridiculous. The shame will hurt much less than dying, I assure you. Hmm. Hmm. Herbert sounds like a good guy. You have an ascending room. Will it take us to the inner sanctum? It will definitely take care of the vertical part of our journey. 
So, you have ridden an elevator before? Yes, the Colosseum at Regent's Park has one. It takes you to the gallery where you can view the panorama. Good. This ride might be a little longer, and in the other direction. Machine room. Well, you know what? That elevator looks like it does some wonky stuff, so let's go check out that room across the hall here real quick before we go over here. Man, I don't wanna I don't wanna leave this area. I don't. Daniel's safe here. You need to stay here and uh, figure something out. I I don't know. You'd probably starve to death, but I at Maybe we should have took the elevator. <laughs> mm, you don't say strange and unnatural. Yeah. You don't say. I, I don't feel comfortable in here either. We're just gonna keep... Crouching. Feel this. I feel like this would gonna be a good place where homeboy would start coming out. Like. <laughs> please. Please. Okay, this is a small building. Okay. Oh, we got some tinder boxes. Real quick. <gasps> 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 All right, guys. We have started the game officially. We're gonna end it here, and we'll keep exploring the storage room and trying to navigate around that thing in the next episode. So, you know, if you like this episode, please leave a like. It's very much appreciated, and if you want to see more of my videos in general, or just Amnesia the Dark Descent, hit that subscribe button, and <sighs> you'll be in for quite a treat, so bye-bye.